Hi, I'm David with J2 Building Consultants. I'm out on an up and coming project and today we're doing adhera testing. Adhera testing is testing for asbestos and possibly lead paint depending on how old the building is. This is testing that is required by the government to ensure that workers and residents are safe when construction is going on. So what we have here is a gentleman from Hawk Environmental and he is taking multiple samples of building materials throughout the building to take them to their lab, test them, and get the results to ensure everybody's safety. So what we're looking at here is they went ahead and took a sample of the vinyl floor covering that's on the exterior of this building. They've patched it in for temporary repair because it will be removed later. They are also going to take a sample of the stucco that's on the exterior of the building. So here, they're prepping with a catch basket, water, and a drill to take core samples out of the stucco. Everything will be contained and caught inside a bag and sealed before testing to ensure everybody's safety. Water is sprayed purposefully to allow dust to be contained while drilling. If there was any kind of contaminant inside this stucco and it did become a dust floating in the air, it could propose a health hazard. So you see the core was drilled and broken out. Now this hole will be patched with sealant until the final repairs to the building are completed. Part of the process is accurate and complete logging of every spot where they take a sampling. Here the technician is writing down a specific number for the project and description of what sample was taken. Then it goes into the bag with a correlating number. So during testing, when the results come back, we have the exact results of everything. In addition, he takes a photo with the sample next to the site where it was taken. Now, this will be cleaned up and filled with sealant for temporary waterproofing. So this is a shot of the patched in sampling site. If the owner requires longer time before the project starts or is unknown when the project starts, this can be either be painted to match the surrounding or it can be permanently repaired. Part of this project is to replace these parapet caps. Going along here, you can see they're peeling from paint and they're in fairly poor condition. The sealant at, east, at these joints must be tested to ensure that there's no hazardous materials in those. When these caps get replaced back, they will be replaced with a pre-finished metal that will not peel and flake. This project also has rooftop decks that are covered in a vinyl sheet good. With that, another sampling will be taken to ensure that these are no different than the ones below. Part of the project will also have to do with some of the roofing. Here they're taking samples of the upper roof membrane, a slip sheet in between, and a roof membrane that's underneath this newer roof.